In Glenwood's 33-year existence, the high school has seen several transitions, including three schools and two mascot changes. But with change, one thing has always been consistent, the coaching of athletics. Four of the current top five coaches in all-time winning percentage are currently leading your Glenwood Titans to a hopeful state campaign every year. Mostly it means you've had great players and, and kids that want to put a lot of time in, whether it's being in season, out of season, summers, you know, I mean, they really concentrate on softball. I really think it was, uh, you know, I, in, in 1993 when I started here, uh, when we won a ball game, it was a big deal. You know, we won three ball games my first year here, and then the fifth year we won nine and got to the quarterfinals, and the sixth year we, we uh, won a state championship. When I was young, it was big, a lot on discipline and, uh, you know, things like that, and it's still that way. It's not coaches that win games, players win games, so you try to, to stay uh, out of it, not get into their head too much so that when they go out, uh, and play the game they play. It's not about what you call. It's not about so much the X's and O's. The integrity of, of a team where whether a coach is watching or not, they're going to do try to do things right all the time. Football, softball, and baseball have all been a sure thing for Glenwood. 21 baseball seasons have been above the 500 mark and the football team making 11 playoff berths in 16 seasons. And all of those seasons have resulted in some successful moments. The thing I remember the most is are just the people. 2005, when we were able to get to the state tournament, that you know, win it, uh, win in the 14 inning game in the uh, sectional, and then turn around two days later, win it in 14 innings against Marion, and win in the super sectional. I kind of reflect on a couple of years in there where maybe we were kind of in between having those really special, talented teams, and and in some of the maybe less talented teams where the kids really, really worked hard to kind of keep our tradition going. In my mind, those, those teams are maybe uh, kind of special to me. Glenwood has predominantly been known for a successful baseball squad. Shortly behind that is the football team that can guarantee the Titans faithful five wins in a playoff berth every season. These are definitely solid numbers that do not need to be tampered with. There's, there's a saying that we've used for a long time, if, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So I don't, uh, I don't think we will be changing too much. We always kind of look at things to see if there's something that we can, uh, some way we can improve a little bit. It's more about the relationships than it is the win. And, uh, you know, so that's the, the, the significance is, is the people that you meet along the way. Coach Rourke currently leads all-time Glenwood football head coaches with the largest number of victories. Behind him is Charlie Connell, and other coaches have ranged from Bob Dixon to Brad Butcher. On the basketball end, current coach Todd Blakeman has some work to do before he catches up with the current leader, Jim Fox, who has over 150 wins in his career. However, things are looking up for Coach Blakeman because he has plenty of time to develop those wins. For The Rush, I'm Alex Fonders, GCNN.